the time has come. I have branded in my memory. Kill is dead. Hello, and welcome to Killer is Dead. <laughs> So, I'm going to have a look at this, um, I'm considering using something in this game for some inspiration for a film, not a Killer is Dead film, uh, for my film Tali, uh, there's an opening section to this game that uh, I vaguely remember. I haven't played this game in like a year, I got it, played it for a bit and then never played it again. Um, there's an opening section in the floor, like an alleyway or something, and um, I was I was thinking that I want how I want to open one of my films, how I want to open Tlee, and I just want to play through this and just see if it's uh, something that I want to do in Tlee, if I want to open Tlee in a very kind of similar way. Um, as you probably realise, I am heavily influenced by video games when it comes to my film work. Probably more than anything else, sort of comics and video games, sort of, I find them to be proper inspiration for the films I make, more than, say, film and television. Um, I don't know why that is, but it's just always been that way. And yeah, so I'm just going to crack on. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Ah, uh, normal's fine. I kinda know how to play this game. the style of this game. <laughs> Ted Sawyer the Iron Man. Hey Cerberus, how's it going? <laughs> Try again, Tetsuo. Let's go get this douchebag. <laughs> no wonder why he does. The thing about this game is I don't think I've ever actually finished it, even when I had it on the 360, so I never really know what the actual storyline's about. Easy, mate. By well, the fact that you really can't. I mean, that doesn't actually even look like the character model of the guy that we play in the rest of the game. This is like a different person entirely. It's got the same suit. Um, this is, I suppose you'd call it, you'd put it probably in the same genre as like, uh, your, your Devil May Cries and your Bayonetta's. It's not as sophisticated as those games in terms of moves, but you've kind of like got 
I think it's all about just dodging and parrying and then just attacking and stuff. It's kind of odd, you'll see what I mean when we get into it. He clearly went that way. Huh. Boom! And that's the fifth time I died. I do like this guy, he probably reminds me of... I don't know if you've ever seen Tetsu or the Iron Man. It kind of reminds me of that. Like he's got a metal disease. Injected himself with rust. Oh, maybe my face is different because I just got shot in the face. And I've had plastic surgery. Because, yeah, see, I'm not... For some reason, I'm not dead. Raspberry jelly. essence went off to the moon. B, how am I supposed to get any better number than that? I, I literally did one thing. <laughs> Maybe it's because it took me a minute and fifty. That's not bad though. 150 grand for cutting the guy's hand and head off. <laughs> yeah, the, the quickening. You're dreading going back to that Sarnia Hill 4 blow through. No, uh, again, it wasn't because of me. Uh, AJ has um, one of her... Which she didn't actually tell me. She said Mars. I don't know if that's a, a relation or a cr close friend of the family, but it's their birthday today. And they're uh, having to arrange, you know, stuff for that. So she couldn't squeeze me in. And I was just like, it's fine. We'll do it next week. Of that, like, fucking proper jazz going on there. I have Tetsu the Iron Man. I've never seen Body Hammer. I keep meaning to watch Body Hammer. I've seen the first one, I love the first one. But as far as I know, I haven't watched the sequel. I really need to get around to doing it. Okay, so as far as I know, that introduction is never referenced again in the entire game. Now all of a sudden we've got a robot arm and and that's pretty much it. <laughs> Episode 2, Killer is Dead. The man who chose the moon. And then Killer is Dead. Cool. I did hear that some, uh, I can't remember, someone told me that I didn't think it was as good as the original. Like it kind of veers into some territory or something that didn't quite fit. I don't know, I can't remember now. It was a long time ago. But like I said, I'll, uh, I'll save my judgement until I watch it. Uh, kill it is dead though. Client Brian Rose's status new mission. Name Damon. 
Wow, he's a tall guy. No, he's 40. Is he America? So yeah, I really do like that alleyway level. Though it's not really a level, I just kind of... Okay, so who's the White King? Or is that the White Queen? Third one. Maybe that's what he was talking about. ごめん。続きはこの後にしよう。仕事を終えてから。もう無理。すぐだって。すぐに終わる仕事だ。終わったら部屋に行こう。なんだ。いいわ。だったら許す。Okay, so we're also part-time James Bond. ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。ワイン。
So this is now one of those wonderful PC ports that's capped at 30 frames a second unless you go into the INI files and uh, you have to change uh, obviously the max uh, blah, blah, max frame rate but then you also have to change all the quick time events so they match the frame rate. I mean it's not a difficult job it's just like for fuck's sake why do I have to make my games run at the proper frame rate? <laughs> Oh look, are you guys actually going to attack me or...? What a bizarre opening level. I mean, I know I put it on normal, but you'd think they'd at least, you know, be somewhat aggressive towards me. そうか。じゃあ俺は祝辞ったのかな。念入りに忠実に職務を全うしてきたつもりだ。違うか、ブライアン。所長はここにはいません。テーブルでお待ちです。あなたと話がしたいと。そうか。ならよかったよ。頑張れよ、シーリー。君もいつか同じ運命をたどるかもしれない。この仕事は闇と向き合うことだ。闇に包まれない光を探しなさい。ありが
俺の人生は正しかったのかこんばんは人生は全て正しい言葉に身を捧げよう殺戮者は死んだ<音声>さあ殺しの時間だ。See again is I guess because I I just took forever. That's probably why I got a C rating. There wasn't anything to do really. This is more story than gameplay. But anyway, I think the game actually starts now. You know what I mean? Kiro is dead. 